hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a Daiso haul. Um, in Japan it's actually the dollar store but here in Australia a lot of the products are $2.80 and there's some little cute products that are a little bit more expensive because they must have cost a bit more to like manufacture and things like that. So what I'll do is I'll go through the bag of goodies that I've got and then in my next video I'll basically create some sort of little snail mail pen pal package for you guys. Um, and yeah, I've got some really cute stationery, so I'll go through that now. The first thing I actually got from Daiso was this adorable little cushion. It looks like it's a cushion for a chair. Now, um, we, we've been told that we most likely will have to work from home next week or soon. They haven't got an exact date yet, but they've been prepping us over the last couple of weeks due to the coronavirus that we'll probably be having to work from home soon. So I got this adorable little couch, not a couch cushion, it's a little chair cushion, so it's a little pad that you put on your chair, just because my chairs are quite hard here, um, the ones that I do have. So this little guy was $6.80. And I thought he was so cute, so I had to get this little one. Um, so yeah, I've been thinking of things of what I would get for around the house in order to work from home and make it a bit more comfier. So that was $6.80. I also, when I walked into Daiso, got this, like, I saw this adorable little dustpan set. Um, it had a little smile on the front and again $2.80 so I actually needed one of these for my kitchen instead of having to vacuum I don't even have one of the large um, brooms so I thought this would be perfect it was adorable and um, I thought the smile on the front was really cute I also got a few little um, food goodies so every time I go to diet I usually pick up a pocky or one of these hello pandas and um, yeah, basically, they're the cheapest, I think, when you go to Dyson and get it from there. Other places, it can cost a lot more. So I grabbed those little, um, snacks. And then, I'll just tip out this bag, so I'm not going back. Hold on. Okay, so, I also got a few things for my little niece. Now, I made a little pen pal package for my nephew not too long ago. I think I called it... Um, what to create for kids or something like that and then I thought oh, I'll make one for my niece as well so I went to Dyson and I picked out a few things that she'd probably like so things like this um, unicorn washi tape set I thought that was adorable um, some stickers so these are animal stickers she loves animals and these ones just have some really cute stickers um, sorry really cute animals on the sticker set I got two washi tape um, little kits so this one is um, Japanese like foods and this one here is the little Japanese Akita dog and when I went to Akita I saw a lot of Akita stationery with this little dog on it so I thought I'd get that because um, it reminded me of my trips, my travels around Japan. I also got these little sprinkles. So my sister said, no glitter. <laughs> She's like, whatever you do, if you send um, Callie anything, do not send glitter. She didn't want it in her house. So these are quite big, um, like sprinkles that I can put inside. I don't even know if they're called sprinkles, but basically they're mermaid theme. And I'm going to put it in a little shaker. Like I'm going to make a little shaker pocket. And then what else have we got? So I've got some more washi tape. This one here is similar to the stickers. So I thought that would be cute for her just to have that little theme. And I also got, this one was pretty funny. This one here is a little garden peg. Um, you actually put it in the garden and it looks like a little light. So I thought that was adorable. I actually have a terrarium that's got little Totoros and um, like mayors and things like that. So I'm going to put it in my little Totoro terrarium. So it looks like there's a little light that can light it up. I just thought that was really adorable. And I haven't seen like miniatures before, like garden miniatures. Also in the little happy mail for my little niece, I'm going to put this adorable marble key ring. It just looks really cute and it matched the whole like unicorn theme and I wanted to add it to the front of her little flip book that I'm creating for her as well as this cute, um, what's it called, um, pencil case. So Daiso has just the cutest stationery and it's all $2.80 which I can't believe how cheap it is. I also got a few letter sets and when I say a few I mean a lot. <laughs> okay, so we'll start off with the big ones. 
So the letter sets were actually really, really cool this time around. Um, again, there's this one that matches the stickers and the washi type. So I thought that was super cute. Um, I'm going to use this one myself. I'm not going to give this one away. I've also got these two, which they're floral. And I've seen something similar when I was in Japan in, what store was it? Loft. They actually had sets like this that were um, like floral and they were actually quite similar. But these ones were $2.80 and the ones that I w that were at Loft, I think I paid like six bucks for. So I thought this was super cute and I'm really liking that they're putting more um, stationery out there each time I go. These are just pretty papers, but I always use these papers when I'm creating my snail mail. So this one particularly was really adorable, but they both are pastel colors, so they match my style very well. <laughs> All right, what is next? I've also got two mini letter sets. Now, a lot of you guys know that I love my mini mail. I do quite a lot of mini mail challenges. Well, I've done two. <laughs> I did one last year and one this year, but I like sending little mini mails I mini letters to people. Sometimes I can't write long letters to everyone. So it's nice just to have a little note, especially for me to put in my uh, packages that um, I'm sending out in my mystery packages in my stationery shop. So it might be nice to have this little note saying, thanks for your order. Um, I hope you like the goodies or something like that. So two adorable little mini mails. These a little post-it notes and they're just really cute they kind of look like uh, watercolor but they're just of Mount Fuji which I love and then these ones again are little greeting cards which I thought would be really nice to also put in the little packages that I'm sending with my stationary orders as well so is there anything that I missed I don't think so that is everything so a lot of washi tape a lot of really cool letter sets at the moment some adorable just like cheap um, stationary bits and pieces as well and then of course some yummy snacks <laughs> the little household goodies and my cute little cushion that I can't wait to sit on when I'm working from home and I'll probably do a, like, a bit of crafting on my hour lunch break at home as well if we get told next week that we're going to be working from home so thanks so much for watching this haul today if you have any questions let me know in the comments below i hope you're all staying safe and i actually joined tiktok i told you my last video and i've been creating some really fun videos on there so if you want to go follow me on tiktok it's just my first and last name so Brittany mccowan thanks so much for watching this video today and i'll see you guys next week bye <laughs>